Hello everyone, this is Everlasting and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be watching Vinland Saga Season 1, Episode 7. Now, I'm worried in this episode because I really like that old that old lady and I'm wondering what happened to her, to her as well as her family and her doggy. I'm really hoping that at least some villagers would survive, but I don't think so. I mean, the last a uh, village that Askeladd and her and his crew uh destroyed no one uh, managed to survive so i'm really hoping that at least one of them would survive and report this because <laughs> uh, the thing is that i feel bad because the old lady is really kind towards uh Thorfinn and I want to see what would happen now. So, despite me wanting to talk more in this intro, I I'm just gonna cut myself off here and just start the reaction now. Where is this? In October. Oh, King Swain's State, Denmark. ロキ休めるのだ。冬の公務は兵力を浪費する。派兵した軍に。Let <laughs> I too, okay? How many years has it been? Is this another time skip? Yeah, I think it's another time skip. They look older. If it, that was Floki at the beginning, right? He looks older. If it's Floki, then he looks older. What's Asgard? <gasps> they look older. Spend all winter like this. だよ。どうするつもりだ。オッケー。どうするのこうするの。渡り鳥と。ウィルドアザバーツトゥ。セセイル。オー。そう、ウェアアユガイズゴイングナウ。ユガナファローザバーツ。フランキッシュキングダム
ずや、ナンジラを勝利へ導くであろう。<笑>トリデが落ちた暁には、戦利品の半分を所望する。予兆を再び突撃されよ。伝えたら、奴らの兵衛に残って、状況を見張れ。わかったらいい。Is that really a good thing? どうした行けよ、タロフィー。これまでにどれだけ殺したと思ってる手柄は十分立てた、うん、なのに You're still not giving him a duel? なんだよ。Well, you did tell him. No, a duel. Well, you did tell him. No, a duel. I mean, that's how you should mount. いつまで逃げ回ってるつもりだ。怖い。辛か,かっただけだって。だがな。それならカブトクミの一つくらい。The head of a commander, at least you give him a goal now. At least. No, you. He's been playing around Tarvin so much. He's been playing him around so much. Tarvin's voice. Ah,、uh, it changed a lot. <laughs> oh, this is the signal? トルフィンからの知らせだ。高く一本、低く二本。急ぐぜ。月が昇りきる前に峠を越えるぞ。小僧、貴様の仲間、コヌではないか。わしも一度見てみたいもんもう日が昇ってしまったぞ。もう日が昇ってしまったぞ。いいから突撃しろ、デム。すぐにわかる。今、なんか悪口言っただろう。うん、どうやら貴様の首は今宵の要求になりそうだな<笑>全身よい全身よい行かん始まっちまった出遅れたぞやろうぞ気合を入れろ戦場が待ってるぜ<gasps> What's with this animation? Oh, God. No.、Oh. <laughs> yep. Well, this is so amazing. I. I... Has it killed already? Yep, he wants your head, Commander. He wants a fight. No, Thorfinn's there. <laughs> That's too gory for my taste. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I don't think I can handle this.、Uh. Oh, my lord. Wow, wow. This is Thorfinn who's been hardened by bat. Ooh, wow. Yeah, take that head. They really showed us. Oh, oh no, 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 the head, the head. Take that one. Your Highness. Your Highness. Is this guy royalty? Really? It's gone. Yeah, they've taken it. No one, nothing valuable is there no more. They've taken it.、Mm. I see. Send him no humble to stay. Then was sure you. What it was, I hope. Monk are mine. Tatito, wait to Masuka. 
トルフィンがまだだぜあら本当。まどうせ死んでる死んでる開け前増えてよかったじゃんThat's the head, yep. I cannot believe that they showed us him beheading <laughs> another character. The fight, yep. You want a, you want a duel? He wants a duel. You're gonna fight? Warrior of Iceland. Oh. I think you will have to rest first. No, not here. At this place? Not now. <laughs> Okay, so it was a bit of a pity that we didn't see the outcome of the old lady's family, but for me, I think it's a bit better <laughs> that it happened that way. I don't have to cry on a corpse or something like that, but yeah, this is quite another episode that I'm a bit afraid of because. To be honest, I only managed to watch. Please wait a minute. Sorry about the sudden noise. <gasps> oh, I look. I look outside my door and saw that my mom was near and she had her tablet on loudspeaker. So you guys heard that. I'm really sorry about that. But yeah, um, I am. Afraid of what happened to Torfin now, like you can see that he's still set on revenge, and I don't know if he's feeling anything other than hatred right now because he's really gung ho on this. I thought he would have some change of mind, but now seeing the way Askela treats him and seeing the way that Torfin knows about that, I can see why he did it. Change the thing. <laughs> like, Askeladd, well, he's very amusing, he's very entertaining to the eyes of the viewer. To the eyes of Thorfinn, he's such a scumbag. <laughs> if he didn't, he didn't give him a goal, he didn't tell, tell him on um, what, on what is the, uh, how should I say this? What is, on what scale is something a great in Battlefield? And so, Thorfinn thought that as long as he killed a lot, that would mean that Askeladd would probably grant him another duel, right? That's what that's what's on Thorfinn's mind. But unfortunately, that didn't happen because Askeladd's just playing him. I mean, he's giving him. He's just playing him. Like he's not. I don't think he even had the uh, intention of actually battling against him. But now, because he gave him a goal, he gave him the deal that he would give him a battle once again if he gets the um head of the commander. And he did. And that's why he manages to get another duel with him. But for now, we don't see the duel. We'll probably see it in the future episodes now. I'm surprised that Askeladd was actually my second most favorite character in the series. But unfortunately, he's getting lower <laughs> while Thorfinn's getting higher on it. <laughs> but the thing is that I don't know. Thorfinn's car my current right now. He's currently my favorite character. Askeladd's gone down a peg. I mean, Thor's is still out there. And Thorfinn, Thor's Thorfinn and then Askeladd. But yeah. I don't know, we haven't met any more characters other than them. Like, we've been watching these seven episodes just watching this set of characters. We haven't really, we haven't really seen more. I mean, from the characters that we've seen in the opening, we haven't met any of them. Aside from Askela we don't, and Foggy, we didn't meet any of them yet. So I'm really looking forward to seeing them, especially that blonde, that 
which had a mask on i'm really curious on his identity we didn't see his face i'm really curious on what he actually looks like as well and i'm really worried i mean it's so much time has passed by so i'm really wondering right now if we'll see what's kind of what's happening in iceland like will we see uh helga and others again or will we not see them anymore i don't know i think like the anime has been focusing on Thorfinn so much that I'm losing hope that we'll even see Leaf and the others again. Maybe once uh, Askeladd is dead or once that Thorfinn finishes his deal with this one, I, maybe he'll return towards Iceland after killing him and then he'll... That's when we'll see Helga and the others again. I don't know. Or maybe we'll see Leaf encounter Askeladd on the middle of the ocean and that's where... We'll see he live again. I'm really curious about that because it's been quite a while. I'm sure that Helga and the others are losing hope that Thorfinn's still alive because they don't know what where he is. They don't know if he's still alive. They don't know what his situation is. And as you can see, Thorfinn he's such a good fighter now, but you guys know that he probably faced a lot of things that he shouldn't have faced as a child and right now as an adult oh no i don't think if he's already an adult or what but his voice has gotten really really deep, deep. so i'm hoping i'm wondering at what age he is right now did another year pass or what i'm really curious about that but yeah um i'm very how should i say this really that Thorfinn managed to get the commander's head and they can get a duel. He can fight against Askeladd again, but I have no idea if he'll be able to win because Askeladd, uh, sh how should I say this? I feel like he won't take him seriously. That's just me though, because the thing is that Thorfinn looks strong against people who are not aware of his abilities. Now, I'm not sure what would happen if Thorfinn faced a person who watched him grow up, who watched him develop the skills, and who watched him and saw him attain all the experiences that he needed, or he, or at least gained this much experiences that he faced or experienced. I don't know if he'll be able to defeat Askeladd as of now. Maybe once Askeladd's older, I mean, when he's at the brink of death or something like that. <laughs> when he's an old man, an older man, not right now, maybe he'll be able to defeat him. I don't know. Maybe I'm just a bit pessimistic, but I don't see him winning right now, at least. I don't know what will happen. I'm really curious now if he'll be able to kill Askeladd even before uh, this anime ends. I mean, even before the season ends, because I've seen the poster of season two, okay? I was a spoil. I'm gonna reveal that. I've seen the poster. I don't think that I've seen Askeladd there. So I'm really curious to see if there is a why he's not there. I believe for me, because I didn't recognize him. <laughs> if he's there, I'm sorry. But yeah, I didn't recognize him, so I don't know if he's still alive during season 2. So I'm really curious to see if he will be killed in this episode. Or rather, in this season. So I'm really curious about that. But yeah, um, we found another race. Frank. Normandy. I... Uh, <laughs> I I ha probably have to rewatch a lot. Because even though I keep saying rewatch, 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 I didn't manage to actually do that because... I was too PC, and as you can see, I'm still clueless. Like, I really have to rewatch at least 6, 7, 8 before I go to episode 9, probably. <laughs> uh, or rather, episode 8. Yeah, episode 8, probably. I have to do a rewatch to make sure that I'm, <laughs> I'm actually understanding everything here. But yeah, um, I was surprised that Thorfinn was still how should i say this he was very gung-ho and i don't know I, I was surprised to see him not bonding well with the, uh, the other uh, crew i mean i can see the bjorn and askela not getting along i mean i can see him not getting along with them but i'm surprised that he really didn't gain any camaraderie or friendship with the others he still has a road as ever with them but i guess i can see why i mean he's not there to 
get friendship or anything like that. He's there to avenge his father. And I don't know what would happen once he does avenge his father. I wonder if he'll go back to Iceland and how will he go back without a boat? Will he hire a boat or something like that? Just like what Thoris had planned when he... When Thoris planned to initial, initially plan to actually arrive at Norway and then hire a boat and go to the place where Floke and him were supposed to meet. And now, I'm wondering what would what Thorfinn's plans are once uh, his current goal is attained. I'm really wondering. And what would happen to these people, to these people that uh, Askeladd has been uh, kind of ordering? <laughs> I wonder what would happen to them once Askeladd's dead. I'm really curious about what would happen about that. That's why I'm rambling again. <laughs> but yeah, I have a lot of questions, but I don't think that the show is giving me any answers right now, so I'm not going to uh, let you know them and bore you to death here. I'm just really curious to see how this would play on because there's definitely going to be a duel. Now, I don't know when, maybe next episode, maybe the next two episodes, I don't know. Maybe they'll side track us with another uh, plot point and not let us see the duel. I mean, I'm really looking forward to it. I want to see how far has Thorfinn go gone i want to see how he will battle with an experienced and knowledgeable um uh, warrior like um asklad and floki i think that was floki in the first part of this episode he's really got an older if it's him if it's him okay if it's him i don't know <laughs> but the scar face i think it's him now Thorkel, the guy that Thoris is with in the first episode. We haven't seen him yet. I don't know if he's already dead or something like that. Or maybe he's still alive and we still haven't seen him. I'm really curious to see if anyone from Thor's past will appear again. Other than Floki, of course. I want to see the other's opinion on Thor's and how would Thorfinn react towards other's opinions on Thor's. So really, I'm really, really curious. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so curious. I am I have a lot of things that I want to talk about. But the thing is that I was so overblown by this episode that I'm not even sure what I'm talking about. <laughs> but yeah, um, we have... Okay, this one. I have to say this before I end this. Why did they make us see a lot? of this general that we're probably not gonna see in the next episode again but the thing is that why do they keep up why do they keep on giving us such close-ups with him like i can't help but cringe on the episodes i don't know if you guys managed to see it but or rather actually saw me cringing but i was actually really cringing hard while seeing him act like ah, la, la, la. and then he says that ah my beauty my tactics made our arm went oh darn it yeah uh he's too overconfident and i don't know if he's still alive next episode or if he's dead or what because we'll probably skip over uh the aftermath of this and see more of thorf and and ask about the willing the next episode we'll probably not see the outcome of this one because i think they're canon fathers for now at least i mean i'm really wondering now what's going to happen because the duel, after the duel, what would happen? That's the thing that's on my mind right now. It's not coming off my mind. That's why I cannot think <laughs> or add more to this review. But that's the thing. I'm really curious on what would happen after the duel. Would Thor after if Thorfinn wins, is everyone on Askel's crew gonna kill him out of revenge for the leader or? Would they let him go or what? And if Askeladd wins, will Thorfinn give up and leave? I don't think he will leave, but we don't know. But yeah, um, I'm really, I'm really, really looking forward towards the next episode. And I hope to see more of Helga and the others. I'm really concerned over their well-being. I mean, at least six years have passed. I want to see how they're doing. And from the last time we've seen Helga, he's, she seemed 
sickly. That's why I'm really concerned right now. I really hope that as I mean, I really hope that the family that Thor is left behind would still be reunited before anything else happens. I like I really have major red flags from Floki and the and Helga's father. I'm really wondering what would happen now. I mean they know Thor they know Thor is dead, but they know that Helga's with her with him. I'm probably I'm sure that Floki probably reported that. Now I'm wondering if his father is concerned enough with Helga that he will order Floki to go after her or what? I'm really curious about that. And after no I mean and yes, 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 I forgot about this. Uh Thor's uh chief, Helga's father, wanted Thorfinn and Helga to have a son. And Thorfinn is a male. So I'm wondering if Thorfinn's grandfather is interested in taking him in. <laughs> I'm so out of my head right now. I'm just there's a lot of furies in my head. That thing that I've said, that's just one of them. <laughs> and I'm really curious to see how this would go. So before I ramble on, I'm just gonna end this reaction right here. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope to see y'all again on the next episode. Bye everyone. Bye bye.